them know what went down. On March 25th, 2020, I withdrew 3908. I tried many times to withdraw the 3908, and it says failed under transfers. I never signed up for Gold Robinhood. I had to turn on Gold to turn off Merge to withdraw the money. I followed instructions and don't see the transfer under, under Transfer Recent. I'll show you that in a moment. A couple of weeks ago, Robinhood crashed for two trading days. People did not have access to their um, investing, their stocks, to sell and buy. And that was a big something. That's when level one circuit breaker on the um, stock market when it, it was it was turned on they had a lot of problems the stock market was crashing but so did Robin Hood platform people couldn't trade buy or sell so they gave people um, a free month of gold which I never wanted so that took me at least 30 minutes to figure out guys that I had to turn it on to turn off the merge to withdraw the money it was annoying, but I learned something, that's, and that's why I'm recording this video, because there is a lot to learn. So then I tell them I turned off gold because I never asked to use gold. Okay, let me, I, I did a lot of screenshots here because I have to hide information. As an example, on March 20th, I initiated a $200 withdrawal. I earned a profit from selling some of um, way to stock. I invested some and I took some. And then it says last updated on the 26th. Today, they send me, I'm taking screenshots because I have to hide some of my information. This is my Gmail account. And this is the way it usually looks. This would be up here and that would be down there. They tell me on the 26th that my request to withdraw $200 from Robinhood to my Citibank account, ending in whatever, has been completed. Well, and then you see it right here. They really did send it to me just a little while ago at 8.34 a.m. And on the 23rd, I received that $200. That's a long gap. Like, everything's delayed. Everything's a glitch. Now, let me show you this. See, on March, on March 25th, I initiated the 3908. But, guys, it won't be available until March 31st. I'm learning. And that's why I'm recording this video, because I can't be the only one that was confused. I'm in, I'm in the learning stages of learning about buying and selling stocks, learning how to use the platforms, and becoming, you know, better at it. But I, I wanted to show you this, because there's a huge lag here. Because I, I see failed that this gives you an indication. I would open them up, but then it gives too much information. One, two, three, four, five. I tried five times until I figured out that I had to turn on the gold that I never wanted in the first place, to turn off the merge that I never wanted in the first place. I believe merge gives um, investors more money faster to invest. And I, then I had to turn it off because I don't want to be charged. I believe it's $5 a month. So I'm letting them know. I'm putting in writing. I then turned off gold because I never asked to use gold. I don't want to be charged for this. I don't want to have to go back, backtrack, and request $5 because they take $5 a month out of your account. So I hope you found this interesting. There's a lot of glitches going on with Robin Hood. So I'm expecting my um, 3908 
estimated availability by March 31st. But you see how it says failed? And they all do. I hope you found it interesting. Be careful. You keep learning, keep growing. And hopefully Robin Hood will figure out the glitches. There are links here. When you click, I don't want to click because it'll show too much information. When you click on transfers, when you click on orders, when you click on rewards, dividends, these don't work in my account. And I wrote them last week about that. It, it, I have to really scroll to get to the dividends and the orders and the rewards. That's a pain in the butt. Okay, folks, you have a good one. Get in the know. Train yourself to make your money grow.